So, you know, last week we had 22, 24 of our staff and our leaders taking a course on how to install solar microgrids in Oboma. Well, here we are on Monday, and, uh, here, and they have this great confidence, and they're doing the electric work and the trenching. Of course, the trenching we didn't do in our class, but to bury the wires. And you can maybe look over here and see them working on getting a battery charged properly using a panel and a charge control. This won't be out here when the system's finished. This will be inside this building or another building with a panel on the ceiling. But we want the batteries to be charged and so they're properly hooking up the electricity for that. So they're amazing. Confidence, expertise, no hesitation. It's really great. Yeah. Light and be the switch in mojo. Yeah. Missouri sauna. One here and one here. Yeah. Good. Uh, it's good because we make this Maasai people uh, lighting because this is uh, a bush place. No electricity. Yeah. So they will charging their phone, they will light at night, yeah, so no dark again. Yeah, we're sitting in a, one of the new houses, newly electrified houses in a Longido Boma. And uh, our team that, we that, that came to the class is installing these very well. And it's very simple, the power comes straight to a double switch. They wire the internal switch correctly, and then one one works the lights, and the other works the cell phone charger. So it's a very basic, very simple, very reliable system. So we're sitting here having chai, having tea, because we came in to check how the system was working, and, and we were offered tea. They have a new stove as well, and it's not smoky in here. So this is a successful Maasai home now. Sure, that. You know, it's 8.30 at night in a Boma in uh, Longido district, and our team of 20, 22 Maasai that we trained with a three-day course has already worked on two Bomas today. They're not quite done, but we're out here at the first light ever at this Boma powered by the new grid that we've established. It's quite amazing. We've just been working like crazy all day today and we're hoping to finish two bombers tomorrow. This team can't be stopped. It's just an incredible group of people working like crazy.